Hi, it's me, Britta, like a Britta filter. Although I've got no filter, but I am very pure. These are my top tips of how to treat a lady right and not wrong. Top banana. One, don't call her by anything that isn't her own name. Like, for example, uh, baby girl, sugar baby, sugar lips, lady luck, weird freak, stupid freak, dumb freak. I mean, I get that a lot and I don't appreciate it. Two, do make sure you ask her what her name actually is. Like this. What's your name? She may or may not answer. It's up to her. Three, make sure you don't take the mick out of her sweet clobber. These sweet threads may not be for you, but that's because they're for me, Britta. I've got the London look, doing the dirty double. Four, don't ask her where her accent's from. She won't appreciate it. Okie doke, cheers. Five, oh, don't be boring with her. Take her dancing. Everybody loves to dance. But do remember that not everybody likes to dance, so try and be mindful of that. Six, make sure you show her a good time. Now this is basically just the same as the dancing one, but uh, it can involve karaoke as well. Seven, stop asking her where her accent's from. She's probably been hearing that all her bloody life, and she doesn't need you asking her it again now. So just leave it, yeah? Eight. If you really want to treat the lady right, make sure you buy her a pizza. Hi there, can I please get the large American hot for a cool British lady? It's for me, Britta. Nine. Everybody loves the movies and ladies included. A top tip is to take your lady to a fabulous film, such as Catcher in the Rye, uh, The Vampire Diaries, Bambi the Buffer Slayer, uh, Magical Creatures and Where to Get Them, uh, Jacob's Creek, <laughs> they're all pretty good. Ten. Stop asking her where her bloody accent's from. Oh, Britta, you dickhead, where's your accent from? Oh, Britta, you dickhead, why do you sound like that? Oh, oh, Britta, you dickhead, why can't you pronounce the word sponge? I've got this accent, yeah, because even though I'm as British as the Bulldog, I've had the absolute privilege of living all over the European Union my entire life. Now, this is admittedly due to my dad's tax evasion. You know, we were like, beep, beep, blah. <laughs> but it was a bloody good laugh. And that's why I speak like this, yeah? <laughs>